Hey guys, it's Jackson from Monster Jam Channel here, and welcome back to another edition of Monster Jam Hot Wheels Holiday Racing. And this year, I mean, this time, it is going to be the Christmas Holiday Racing Series Championship. And as always, we have a really good lineup of trucks here, and I expanded the field to 14 this time, you know, just to make it bigger and more exciting every time you come and watch it. So yeah, um, our field of trucks will be Crush Station. Wrecking Crew. Now keep in mind he won the hall the uh, Halloween Halloween Racing Champion. Sorry, he was the Halloween Racing Champion, but it's a different paint job. So yeah, I don't know if that counts, but I'm just gonna count it anyway. So that yeah, we also have Mohawk Warrior, Monster Hunt Dalmatian, the Old Red Grave Digger, Captain's Curse, War Wizard, Freedom Force. El Matador, The Broker, El Toro Loco, Instigator, U.S. Air Force Afterburner, and Black Stallion. So yeah, guys, these are all the trucks that will compete on this track, this ever-fast track for the Holiday Racing Series. And yeah, let's just get right into the video. Our first pair matching up will be Crush Station, or as they call it, the Monster Lobster in the northeastern part of New England, and Wrecking Crew, the new paint job version. So anyway, guys, let's get this first race underway. It looks like it will be Crush Station, crushing the, uh, sorry, crossing the line first. And he will go on to be the winner of the first race in round number one. So Wrecking Crew is out. Good thing, because that saves fairness to, you know, him winning again. So yeah, and this track, once again, is falling apart. So please stand by again. Guys, we have the track fixed again, so let's do another race. Our next pair up will be War Wizard and Freedom Force. War Wizard will be the lane. And Freedom Force will be in the other lane. Sorry for the music, guy, uh, the noise in the background, guys. Someone's watching a movie. So anyway, let's go. It will be Freedom Force winning this race. And he will go on to advance to round number two. War Wizard will be... No, wait, sorry. War Wizard will lose and Freedom Force will go on to advance. So anyway, yeah. That's our second race done, guys. Let's move on to our next one. Our next race will be Mohawk Warrior. Nice to have this truck. And Monster Mutt Dalmatian. Fun fact, Monster Mutt Dalmatian has been in every single one of my holiday racing videos except for the first one. So, yeah, it's a good opportunity. Hopefully, she'll get a victory. So, anyway, let's go. It looks like Mohawk Warrior will take the win here. And, guys, in case you forgot, I told this last time in my last video... Whoever crosses that line first is the winner, and I saw Mohawk Warrior do it, so he will advance. Tough break for Monster Mutt Dalmatian, but, you know, I'll invite her back to the next one. So, yeah. Sorry, not this time. Anyway, our next pair will be... Grave Digger, the old red one, versus... Versus Captain's Curse. No, wait, sorry. Um, El Matador will be facing the broker next. Sorry. So anyway, El Matador, next. And El Matador is another one of the trucks that has been in every single one except for the first one. So yeah, that is a good opportunity for him to get a win. Let's go. Oh, that was a close one. I think that was Broker. I don't know. Um, wow. I, I have no idea, actually. I'm just going to judge it this once on who's closest. It looks like just barely broke. I don't know. I'm going to rerun that race. Sorry, guys, but that was a really close one. And since there's that wall right there, I can't tell who, if just the light. Sorry, guys. Sorry, I mumbled. But, yeah. So, anyway, we're going to rerun the race. That was a very close race, and I'm sure there's many more to come. So, anyway, let's do it again. Guys. Wow. Both trucks, red light. Let's keep them on the starting line. And as if and I have if I mention haven't mentioned this before, guys, Merry Christmas. And so yeah. Hopefully no one red lights this time and we can continue on. 
This time the true winner is Broker. So Broker will advance into the next round. Well, El Matador will be off to the side for now. Sorry if El Matador won the first time. I just could not tell. That was like a super close race. Fixing the track a little bit. Putting some maintenance on it. So yeah. Our next race will be the Old Red Gravedigger versus Captain's Curse. Alrighty. Alright, here we go. Wow, that was another close one, I think. Yeah, I saw it. It was Captain's Curse with the win. Wow, we're getting some close races here in the first round of racing for the Christmas edition of the Monster Jam Hot Wheels Holiday Racing Series. So yeah, hopefully we'll get many more close finishes. Our next race will be El Toro Loco, a truck that has actually been in every single one of these. I think she's actually, I mean, not she, sorry. Um, the El Toro Loco is the only one that's been in all of my Monster Jam Hot Wheels Holiday Racing Series races. So yeah, she's a really popular, yeah, sorry. Um, it's a really popular truck. And I just like to keep it so you can see it race. And so anyway, let's go. Round number one of racing, the last race. It will be Instigator with the win here. It will advance on to round number two. And El Toro Loco will be off to the side. Sorry. Anyway, um, that wraps up round one, guys. And in case I haven't mentioned this, um, these two trucks right here, they're actually going to be... They are the fastest qualifiers, so they will go head to get head. Um, U.S. Air Force Afterburner will go ahead to head against Quartz Station, and Black Stallion will go head to head against Freedom Force. So anyway, guys, let's start that up. Round number two of racing. It'll be U.S. Air Force Afterburner. It was so fast in qualifying when I timed them. Oops, sorry, technical difficulties. Please stand by. Sorry for the talking, guys. Alrighty, we have it fixed. Hopefully, we have it fixed. One second. Oh, sorry, guys. I'm just trying to fix this. Hmm. There we go. Finally, we'll stay. And he will go ahead again against Course Station in the next round of racing. So here we go. Course Station versus Joseph Air Force Afterburner. Wow, another close one. I think it was U.S. Air Force Afterburner, I think. I don't know. We're going to rerun that race again, guys. Sorry, but there's just no way of telling who did it. Um, as I predicted, we all have many close finishes in this edition of the Hot Wheels Holiday Racing Series. So anyway, let's rerun this race. Oh, a little red light. It's not fair, so we're going to advance. Sorry if this video is going to get a little long, guys. I just want to make it fair and fun for you to watch. So anyway, let's go on. Oh, U.S. Air Force after murder keeps slipping out. Sorry, guys. Please stand by for one moment. Alright, here we go. Finally, hopefully no one will red light. Wow, I cannot picture that. That is just... I'm just going to count Crush Station as the winner. He will advance into the second round. And you will pull the upset of the night against U.S. Air Force after murder. Our next pair up will be with Black Stallion, which I predict will win. Which I predict will win. And... Freedom Force, who's been a good contender all year. Oh, a little black stallion with a little red light. This truck looks pretty cool with the neon green rims and the pink job. I like it a lot. So anyway, let's go. Round number two, racing. Second race. Let's go. It will be Black Stallion with the win. Yes. We'll go on. Freedom Force will be put off to the side. 
little truck maintenance. Please stand by. Sorry, guys. Did I mention that I got the Earthshaker Monster Jam truck? That's a pretty sick truck. I made a video on it, so, yeah. Anyway, back to racing again. Sorry, this track is just not cooperating. Our next race will be... Broker. Oh, lane. Versus Captain's Curse. Alright, here we go. It will be Captain's Curse, I think. That was another close finish here in racing. Sorry. This is turning out to be one of the greatest holiday races of all time. The track's not broken, so we can continue on. Our next race will be Mohawk Warrior. Oh, got a red line, Mohawk Warrior. Versus Instigator. Right, here we go. It will be Mohawk Warrior. Another close race. This is some of the cl most close racing I've ever seen. I'm going to put Captain Script on so. Alright, guys. Our final four contenders will be Mohawk Warrior, Captain's Curse, Crush Station, and Black Stallion. And that's weird because I predicted that. Actually, um, U.S. Air Force Afterburner would win, but okay, that's what you—that's what we can expect from the this competition. So anyway, our next race will be Crustacean versus Mohawk Warrior. Oh, what is it with the trucks red lighting? Sorry, guys. The monster lobster is hungry to be the winner. Let's see who will win this race. Wow, Crustacean will win it against Mohawk Warrior. He has got a chance to win here. And Mohawk Warrior will go to this pile of trucks that have lost. Sorry. And our final race will be, well, not final, but just second to last, will be Mohawk, no, sorry, Captain's Curse. Versus Black Stallion. Here we go, guys. The last, the second to last race. The winner of this race will go on to face Crustacean in the championship round. Gosh, what is it with the red lights? I don't believe the speed disqualification, but you know, it's just the tracks that are faulty in their toys, so yeah, they can't help it. Oh my goodness. Sorry, guys. Please stand by. Please enjoy the black, the background noise as much as possible. All right, here we go. I think Black Stallion is just going to go. I don't know why. Ugh. Let me see. One second, guys. Oh my goodness. It's turning out one of to be one of the most difficult. There we go. I predict that it'll be Black Stallion, but that's just me. Anyway, let's go, guys. It will be Black Stallion advancing into the final round against Crustacean. I expected that the championship race would be Black Stallion against U.S. Air Force Aftermurder, but, you know, stuff happens. Um, it can be unpredictable. Again, please stand by as it's struck. Make the track as perfect as possible for this final round of racing. All right, guys, here we go. The final round of the Christmas holiday racing. Will it be Black Stallion, like I predicted? Or will it be Crustacean? He's been fast all night long here. So anyway, let's go. Do the We Will Walk You. Sorry, you can't see my pants. All right. Alright guys, it is time for another championship race of the Holiday Racing Series. Who will win? Will it be Black Stallion or Crustacean? Here we go! It will be Black Stallion with the win! 
It was a close race, but in the end, Black Stallion would take it home tonight as the Christmas Holiday Racing Champion. He will park himself on top of the rest, and the other trucks will come out once again for an encore. The encore this time will be the trucks driving over. Oh, Black Stallion. Again, just wants to keep going, but he's already won. Alright, here we go. Special encore for you. Alrighty, here we go. Special encore. For this encore, the trucks will drive over each other. Here we go. little backflip for Freedom Force. And Crustacean will go on top next to Black Stallion. If he'll stay there. Does it look like it? Yep, he'll stay there. Well guys, thank you for watching. This was by far the best holiday race I've seen. Hopefully there will be more spectacular ones to come here. Congratulations to Black Stallion for winning. And as always, guys, thank you for watching and Merry Christmas. And make sure to subscribe, like the video, comment down below if you liked it or not. And then, you know, just do that so you don't miss any more stuff. And, you know, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.